Hello, Danny McMullen here. Um, just want to make a quick video. I was outside looking at my wife's morning glories today, and I had looked at them for these couple of plants that she has for the last couple of months. And here you see a purple one, and it's really pretty. And if you notice, uh, the plant that it's coming from is it's not a really big plant. It's actually got little tiny leaves on it. I don't know if you can see them, but they're pretty small. And so it's a, if you just look at the plant, it's like, almost looks like it's not doing very well. But quite often it, it'll have flowers on it for the last couple months that they're in bloom, or have been in bloom. It's had flowers you know, every couple of days. And then, so now I want to turn the attention over to this other plant. If you look at this one here, this one is filling up the whole, the whole terrace or towel, whatever this thing's called, the thing that the plants grow, grow on. Um, it's very, very full. I mean, huge leaves all the way from the bottom to the top. Now, the interesting thing about this one is that it's been big like this for oh, a couple of months. I think we planted them in like May or something. Now it's September, and this one just exploded. But what's interesting is that this one has never had a single flower on it. It's supposed to be blue flowers, as far as we're aware, but it's never had a, a flower on it. Uh, it's kind of taken over the whole space. So it got me thinking that this is sort of a example, if you will, of how things are with with our lives. Because often I feel like I'm, you know, small. Um, I'm not important. I don't have power. I don't have a lot of ability to communicate all that great. Um, people don't think I'm special, you know not famous I mean even if you just like I I work at Walmart you know I I wouldn't be considered successful as far as this world standards are concerned but um and I'm sure a lot of people feel the same way that they're you know just little and small and there's so many, there's other people that are doing all these big important things and uh, the world notices them. They're just oh wow that person is doing so great. They're so you know wow they're so gifted this that and the other thing. And I'm just sitting here in my house and I got really very few skills and et cetera et cetera. But I was just thinking how it's it's not so important the show that you put on the how big and powerful and skilled and everything that you appear to be the important thing is is if you have fruit in your life even if it's small and seemingly not that important to you know the world and how it's how it looks if you have fruit that's all the lord cares about and that's all he looks at that's all he's interested in and so it's kind of like this plant here, just tiny little plant down here, which puts out a flower every once in a while. But it's not an impressive looking plant. Or you can have this big impressive plant, which never puts out any flowers at all. So I, I just was, thought that was interesting how was like the Lord kind of showed me like a, I don't know, a truth. But he used his creation to kind of show it to me. Because... You know, I, I struggle with that feeling like I have no impact at all. Um, just, it's like, why am I even here sort of thinking, you know? And I'm sure I'm probably not the only one that feels that way. But So I just wanted to, maybe this could be encouraging because it was encouraging to me. Um, just think of yourself in sort of this way, that you don't have to be this big, uh, robust plant that everybody notices. All you have to do is, what's important is that you put forth fruit, or in other words, you have a flower, you produce flowers. 
So, anyhow, I wanted to share that, and I hope that was helpful. Uh, thank you for watching, and God bless.